please do not pass by and look over my website. Hello there. I am very glad that have joined this forum and want to give you a look on my forex related project. The website is up and running and as you can see a couple of well known brokers set up a chimerical on our resource. From the operational standpoint everything is ok as we are currently working with a team of Higley skilled forex traders. What do you think of the design? Is the layout good? We are targeting the global market so please do not judge strictly on written English. Does the website call you to actions? Any feedback will be much appreciated. I'm not your target market but I didn't understand what the first part of it meant at all. I understood the ending, where I might make money with Forex but other than that I didn't look at anything else. What do you mean by the first part? Did you click on signals, packages, about? Does the title? Didn't even look at it. Your top ad above it made me completely disregard that section. Your site is a regulatory nightmare. You don't have a real terms of use policy or any real disclaimers. But you represent yourself as a financial advisory and then combine this with passage like make plus 20% and a reasonable return. Obviously this has not been scrubbed by legal, which should be your first step considering it's about financial advice, signals, trading, and risking capital. Otherwise, some copywriting would serve you well too. Got it now. We'll move up the banner shortly. Or make it a smaller size. What do you think? Thanks for that. You meant something like that, correct? Yes. Not to be rude or anything. That home page threw me off. Looks like a five year old did it. I wouldn't trust that site at all. Don't forget, looks do matter. 1. Why would you even have a banner ad on your website? Makes no sense at all. 2. Your URL does not inspire confidence in Forex trading. I think it's a crappy name and just sounds like a join me affiliate site. 3. Your login page is not secure as a trading service site. It just looks too amateurish to me. It would be good if you would have some proof of your performance by getting verified trades on MyFixbook for example. Why would you have banner ads that take people off your site when you are offering a software solution which should be your core offer? Make it look professional. Edit has been fixed. As someone above said, cool pay has nothing to do with forex trading. Your home page in no way draws in customers. It's all vague mumbo jumbo that reminds me of a pyramid scheme. Needs a whole lot of work, got it. I thought a plain and easy design would be more attractive as opposed to the rest of Forex related projects. The highlight of the website lies within. Feel myself like a five year old. By the way, how do you think it should look like? Can you give me a couple of worth examples? I was seriously waiting for a sparkling gift to show up on one of the tabs. 1. Probably makes no sense but makes money for the website. Does it make you disregard the home page? Do I need to make a banner ad a bit smaller? Or put at the bottom of the page question mark 2. I thought the opposite way. Wanted to add something fresh to the forex market. Sick of fx, forex. Xpro related domains. 3. What level of security you want to see over there? Like that one? Good point. We have multiple accounts on different Forex related forums. My Xbook to be added soon. You may go ahead and check out our FB page. Lots of customers are following our trading tips there. What? Offering a software solution? You serious? Did you look through the website? Appreciate that sort of feedback. How do you think I should go about changing the home page? I actually need to draw in customers. I have no idea what do I get when I subscribe either. Is it a video course, a software or an email newsletter? Make it blatantly clear. Besides that, you are in some way promising people will make money with your tips. 
At the same time you display ads in home page which makes me think you make more money by the ad than by your own service or advice itself. Try to clear up confusion and cut through the BS, right to the user benefits. Got it mate. Apparently the website needs a full-fledged update. One so you get a visitor and the first thing you want him to do is click on a banner ad and leave your web page to make a few. Are you trying to get someone to sign up for your course or are you trying to make a few per visitor? You need to take the banner off your page completely. You recommend that company after they pay for your course. Three, your create account page needs SSL. Here are my opinions. One, the UI is terrible. Two, you need to hire a developer now. I can get you in contact with a few should cost maximum 3k. Three. Please tell me you didn't pay for this site. Four. Your site is very .com template looking. Five. I still have no idea what you are. Six. There isn't any keyword optimization or SEO integrated into your site. Seven. Need more. Eight. Doesn't look credible. I genuinely believe the guy in Nigeria has a better website than this. Few points. Number one, your topic title on this forum made me just puke in my mouth. Really, trying reverse psychology on professionals? That topic already made me expect a terrible and fraudulent site. Number two, you put a lot of claims with no backup. Number three, looks like someone put this site together with WordPress in about five minutes work. Number four, very bad name, once again reminds me of a terrible and fraudulent site. Number 5 Read over all your texts again, every bit of text I read on your site shouts scam fraudulent big no no if I was interested in investing, I would click away within about 3 seconds from your site, and if I somehow stayed on it I would click away after reading your texts. I see free trial I think I get a software solution to some kind of problem, and that I get a free trial of the software. Whether you like it or not. 99% of people will look at small cues like this and not look through the website. Fall in love with the customer first, not with the product. One I am trying to get someone for our trading plans. You're right, need to take the banner off the page. The thing is that I've got an agreement with those two brokers. The primary task is to make the customers sign up for cool pay but to trade our signals they need a reliable broker. That's why you see banner ad on the home page. We'll try to clean it up. 2. I totally agree with that one. It needs so thanks for the feedback. 1. Sorry that my topic made you vomit did not expect that not even trying reverse psychology on professionals. 2. Agree 3. You can go ahead and show me your work in WordPress.4. What name your prefer, Jude? I am sick of FX, 4X, FXPro related domains, therefore picked up something new.5. Half agree. I need to update texts and put up testimonials on our traders. Please, show me a worth example of 4X signals provider. Thank you. Now I got it. Thank you. One it's a very classic example of reverse psychology taught in high schools and the like, especially a few years ago it was very overused. Most sites or businesses have luckily grown out of it. Do not do this, do not do that and then hoping that they actually would since someone doesn't like to be told not to do something. Three, my sites are currently not yet online. I got one site in the waiting line build on hybrid core with the parent theme Stargazer and one site in the waiting line build on Genesis with the parent theme Daily Dish. But if you want a few examples of famous sites using WordPress, I won't spam links to them on this forum. If you want to check them up a quick Google will fix that. Harvard, Sony, Beyonce, Snoop Dogg, Amkf, BBC, ESPN. Xerox, Star Wars, TechCrunch and many others are built in WordPress. For anything that sounds professional really, I'm not in the forex trading business myself, in fact I know almost nothing about it. So my view is purely from an outside perspective.
your name has several good and bad things good points colon something new easy to remember bad points colon sounds very cheesy and an extension of that sounds unprofessional dot now if you were dealing in almost any other product that does not involve direct money or big purchases your name would be a good one dot but if you're dealing in big purchase real estate etc or direct money banking investing etc you want to avoid cheesy or unprofessional sounding names 5 again I'm not in the forex business but I did a quick google while I find a lot of sites to whom I would never trust my money a few stood out with my first reaction being more trustable this is mainly due to layout clean design and non pushy texts dot for x signal dot com by for x signals dot com for x signals dot com this one probably has the best texts of them all if I would choose to buy Forex signals, this would be my favorite to start with, before doing actual in-depth research about the company. Their site is bright, simplistic. Their texts show honesty and integrity. They have their faces added to the website, shows a form of accountability and trustworthiness. Even their testimonials don't say wow they're that awesome as the first one I read was their signals are not 100% accurate, but they get very close that sounds pretty honest and trustable to me. Again just by quickly skimming through their site. Cheers. Jit.1 Alright, let's my topic be involved with reverse psychology. I did not think of it when posting the thread but I must admit I wanted to attract everyone's attention to my topic.3 My website is not using the word biscor. It's been built completely from scratch. However, I'll definitely look through the examples you posted above.4 Please look over my Forex related blog in WordPress. Is Fx cool better than cool pay I mean the name? What do you think question mark 5 very good example of yours. I am gonna redo the content to make it more trustworthy. No bloody slogans make 20% a month, correct? Just plain and bright sight with the right texts. Cool pay sounds like an electronic payment service. Like PayPal or Venmo. I actually think it's quite good for that use. For a Forex signal provider I don't think it's that good. It's too focused on paying and not trading signals. I don't think the make 20% a month is bad from a copywriting perspective. But, it will likely get you in legal trouble since you can't guarantee it. Also, the banner ad has to go. It has no place on your sales funnel page and immediately makes me think I'm dealing with an amateur that is trying to earn a few pennies through banner ads. We'll definitely take this banner off the home page. Thank you for your feedback. Yup agree that the name Cool Pay focuses too much on the paying like one or two texts like make 20% a month or a claim that you can guarantee you can do. If you look at the sites that I posted, they have some very subtle call to actions. Something that you might want to look into is the psychology of colors. Different colors call for different emotions. Do you want to be seen as a hot site with a lot of quick short time results? Or do you want that your customers are with you for the long run? To which of the two is your approach the best? The hot or short time site could be with bright colors, big call to action buttons and so forth. Get possibly a higher amount of customers with a low amount of returning customers. The stable or long time site should be more such as the sites I linked as an example. Get a fair amount of customers with a high amount of returning customers. For example the color orange is one of the least favorite colors of women. However it is the best color for a call to action. Look at all the big sites. Their buy now or sign up now buttons all have the orange background. Blue stands for stability, integrity, honesty. And is liked by both genders. Red is a color hated by men, but loved by women for some reason. Etc. 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 If you look at the Forex Signals site that I posted, they have three different plans and use three different colors for it. Their recommended choice is a bright blue color stability. Honesty etc. Their cheap one is an soft orange color impulse buying, but since it's a light orange it is also more earth or a secondary choice as the main choice is a bright color. Psychologically seen you want to evade colors such as, brown, black, yellow.
black is only okay for text on a white background. Yellow seems to be the worst choice as it is seen as the color of now she sickness irritating and so forth. White seems to be the best performing background color. Although I do like your soft or light blue as well. This makes me, as a customer, to think about all the horrors of the financial industry. Remember, I would only turn to an advisor if you are credible. I.e. When I read to do it means that you have not yet been committed to help me, to secure my information etc. You are offering something that I don't need or want to have. You have disregarded the customer in my opinion. And as some others said, you need to be more specific. This is what you need, this is what you have, this is what you want, this is what you need. Psychology of colors does make sense. Seriously I need to redo everything on the site. Probably will just keep the light blue background but rebuilt tabs, add new sections, of course disclaimer. How about the name? Cool pay is too much about paying and you're right. Fk school sounds better. We're offering a trading signals service that helps you generate a 20% return each month. That's our slogan but I am okay with your comment. Probably I need to sort all things out and divide clearly sections into Forex signals list of packages, Forex fund magarment how we can trade your funds and so forth. Well, you could go on two ways about the name. By your previous comments I got the impression that it's important for you to be different name wise. So FX Cool is not so different than any other FX site. However, the name would be clear, nobody would doubt if it is about Forex or about a paying service. To me, it does seem that you want to build a brand around Cool as you want to keep that part. So, if you plan on extending to other services in the future with Cool in it, then FX Cool makes sense. Or Cool FX Cool Forex versus Forex Cool. The cool forex does seem to be more easy to remember and more fluent to say just my thoughts on the name. In the end any name is fine as long colon it is clear what your services are. Or it is a famous brand Nike, Adidas, Armani etc. Is easy to remember is easy to pronounce has a low chance to be misspelled if someone would type it in in the internet. FX cool instead of FX cool. Unless you buy that domain as well and redirect towards the site. Dot does not have a different bad meaning in another language. You don't want to be connected to something bad. For example, there is one car that is a random name in one country, but means wanker in another. A good example of a big naming fail. Of course, nobody from that country would pay $50.000 for a car that means wanker. You know after reviewing all the comments I think Fxcool would be a better option. Yes, you are right. I am buying a brand around cool. So what we have for now, Fxcool gives a clear picture of what my services really are, easy to remember? I think yes, easy to pronounce? Buy the Fxcool domain, it might be a good solution as well. The last point is terrific lol. I totally forgot about those intercultural and language differences. Need to conduct a bit of research before I get started. Hello there. Happy 2015. Best of luck in all future endeavors. Has anyone signed up for the website? Did you see dashboard? I am thinking on keeping the layout with no further amendments. Probably need to take the second banner off as well. I am gonna add a couple of more instruments. I got Forex and binary options for now. Any comments on this will be much appreciated. I've been working with a client in the FX space for the last three years, and working with other clients in the finance industry for 10. So I think I'm in a fairly good position to give some pointers in short, some quick fix recommendations. Tighten up your offer. In the first sentence on the site you mention yet all other indications point to the signals being your primary product, with financial advisory service being something you can also offer, yet provide no further info about this do you advise on stocks? Mutual funds? 401ks? IRAs? etc. I therefore recommend focusing primarily on the signals side of things first which you seem to do anyway. 
as per your packages page. You can always upsell other financial products with existing customers afterward anyway. If they are happy with the current service or product they get from you, they are more likely to purchase more products. The other thing being, you are for the signals service, but don't mention a timeline. Will you offer these daily, weekly, once a month? What time frames? Therefore I recommend revising that first statement to something like, as others have mentioned, the domain name is a bit misaligned as well. Although you may hate the FX type domains, you aren't the customer, and for the most part the customers are expecting a more regular name. There are a bunch of other things you could clean up or fix etc. But hopefully those help. My advice, check out your competitors, see what they are doing, and see how you can do it better. Your first step should be taking that banner ad off the home page. Very distracting. Thanks a lot, mate. Seriously I have nothing to add. Pointers are clean and understandable. I will be better focusing on one product now trading signals with no other financial advisory service offerings. Don't even remember why I put it up on the website. Yeah, the time frame does matter as well to be fixed. The primary objectives here is to sell affordable trading signals. Competitors send out signals at the price of $100 and up which is quite expensive I think no matter what trading skills you have. The site will be completely rebuilt but the rates remain the same. I think that's our advantage over other Forex signal services. Grammar mistakes, or... Sorry for that, gonna rewrite the texts. Definitely will do that. Thanks. Hi again. Been surfing lots of websites and stumbled upon these guys. I know I should not do it but does their website look far better than mine? Everything's nice and clean with no banner ads. Having proof of the daily trades and apparently that's really them team's photo who run the business. I think the guys are doing really good but I need to find the way to do it even better. So, what are you going to do about it? Having examples is a good thing, as long as you don't idolize them. I read and watch forums, blogs and websites all the time in the niche where I'm building my site for. Go slowly as I'm not a programmer, but most edits I do are in code. But then again I have the time for now, as I can't put the site online yet anyways. At least not on a paid domain. Cheers mates. It's been quite some time since I've posted my last comment here. I've been looking through a bunch of Forex related websites and finally came up with this one. The website is still under construction but the main features are working properly private cabinets, free trials, etc. As someone wrote me here that I need to fall in love with the customer first, not with the product I've altered my priority list and made the website more user friendly no banner ads, put up user agreement and will do the disclaimer shortly. There's still not much text but all the pages will be adjusted to SEO keyword search and updated too. The link to my Facebook account will be added as well. Just give me some of your pointers. Thank you. You said do not pass by my website, then why are you asking for our opinions? Or, it was just a wrong interpretation of the expression. Sorry about that. Cheers mates. I've cleaned up a bunch of things on the website but still think I am missing something. I focus primarily on Forex signals and fund management services with no advisory stuff. The name is more Forex related now I send out the trading proofs to my clients via MailChimp. The corporate FX account will be linked up to my Facebook shortly but I am not sure we need to post it on the home page, how do you think? Once you sign up with our website you get all the information regarding signal setups and daily analysis via mailing and private cabinets. A blog page still not working. It will be fixed in a couple of hours. Hey Jog, just a quick heads up. On iPad, your menu does not display. Might be worth testing on multiple devices. 100% sure 80% to 100% return weekly. Hi, thanks for the notice.
just found that it had a glitch on the mobile version of the website. Need to fix this ASAP. Takes way too long to load, said FKIT and closed the tape edit, might be my connection. But honestly looks too plain. It's just lacking, I don't know how to describe it. Cheers. What am I still lacking, cheers mates. I know it's been a long time but I've updated the website again and please have a look at the newest version. The mobile release is not yet launched as we're now focusing more on fund management and signal service. If you are up to that you may go ahead and sign up free 7 day trial with FX Cool. The back offices are quite plain but served only as a signal delivery platform. When our traders post a signal setup it immediately mere seconds displays in your account which is quite handy I think. Questions and comments are welcome. Hello. Is anybody out there? LOL. But looks is not all that matters. They can always be modified. Your website looks quite cheap. Take any forex broker and you will see that they all have a lot of content on the index page. You need more relevant content. News section and other user friendly sections. The only thing I like about your website is this big red button. Good luck. Hi mate, with my best intention I am going to say my opinion. I work in finance industry and I can assure you that creating confidence in your website is the key. Your website does not create confidence. First, your top bar mostly outsources the links to other pages which take quite a while to charge. Second, your main text looks like a word document copy and paste, please define it. I think that any of your users will read everything. Third, I find that the markets maps is quite useful. Maybe if you purchase the plugins and you can remove the plus add to your site stuff will be much better. Even they provide good tools. I would change the message saying something like for your successful trading we have all of this. Finally, the three boxes that you have at the bottom. Please, remark it as they are your competitive advantage. There are hundreds of platforms like this, just make clear that yours is the best one. This just my very own personal opinion, I do not know where do you live but hiring a web designer for some consultancy is definitely worth. This sector needs confidence and in internet confidence is done through appearance. Best of luck. Cheers mate. Thanks a lot for your feedback really appreciate it. You are more than right about creating confidence. We just put efforts into the track records thinking that trading accounts would bring us more credibility as traders want to see the history of real trades. We've finally done this and you can check it out on the website. Main text looks plain and I think we gonna rewrite again posting up new slogan and brief description of our service. Good point about the plugins. Apparently it will be a great deal. Cheers mates. Is anybody out there with a forex or stock trading experience? If yes please drop me your line. What you think of the home page and does the website call you to actions? Apparently there are no more pros in that forum forum forum.